Welcome back. Over the last four years, expectations have changed for the Huntington Raiders. Anything less than the playoffs is unacceptable to Stephen Dennis and his staff. I caught up with Coach Dennis as his Raiders look to light up the scoreboard in 2023. With seven starters returning on both sides of the football, expectations are sky high for the Huntington Raiders. Now one spot where they do have to replace a star is at the quarterback position. Cam Evans is gone. Lost to graduation in Texas Southern University. In steps Lorenzo White Jr. to the quarterback position. LJ's natural personality, he rides right in the middle. You know, he never gets too high, never gets too low, never really gets rattled. You know, I noticed that about him even when I was watching him play in middle school is, man, he was just getting hit in the mouth, dropping back to pass, and he didn't, didn't get too high, didn't, didn't get too low. And so I think his natural even kill and ability to stay calm in, in, in highly uh, stressful situations is going to give him a skill set to, to, to really lead our football team. Really just everything, timing down with the receivers, being a better leader, vocal, on and off the field, helping my teammates. Really everything. I can pass the ball, run the ball, I can do anything the coaches ask me to do. Now the Raiders have weapons all over the field, especially on offense, so look for Huntington to light up the scoreboard come the fall. Reporting at Huntington High School, I'm Tim Owens. Coach Dennis and the Raiders open the season on Friday, September 1st, when they play host to the Mansfield Wolverines. Kickoff for that game is set for 7 o'clock. The Johnny's Pizza preseason blitz rolls on tomorrow night as we go inside the huddle with the Benton Tigers and Calvary Cavaliers, and then we get an inside look at the Parkway Panthers on Monday at 530.